Hey YouTube, what's up everybody? This is um, Grunt, and today I'm going to make a video um, showing some new um, features added to the Gruntio OS file system. So let's start off by booting in a Gruntio OS. Now I already messed with this, so I'm going to make a fresh install real quick just so everything is how it's supposed to be. And I'm just going to make my password um, test for the purpose of this video. And now we can reboot. Alright, so we um, are logged on and we are in the home directory right now. Logged in as Grunt. So if I do the, um, if I get the directory listing right here, and if I use the long format, as you can see, it has um, Grunt out files, and that's because all those files are owned by the user Grunt. But if I go to the root directory, and if I go into um, ECMT, and if I do a directory listing here, we can see that all these files are owned by um, system. And these files are protected, so normal users cannot modify them. So just um, to show this, I'm going to try to delete the directory profile. So I'm going to click unlink, which is the command to delete files, and then slash ec2 slash profile. As you can see, we get this access denied message, and that is because um, it is owned by the user system, and only the user system can make modifications to that. So, I try to change this using the chmod command. I try to change it. Still get an error access denied because um, I, the user Grunt, is not allowed to write at all to that file or the file entry file system. So if I use the um, sudo command to get super user privileges, and if I run the chmod command. on profile. It's going to ask for my password, and then it changed it to um, 777, which basically allows all users to read, write, and execute. So that means that I can now delete this file. So if I type in arm link slash ec2 slash profile. We do not get an access denied message, and if we do a directory listing, as you can see, it is not there anymore, and that is because we just deleted it. So now, if we um, we go back to the root directory and into the bin directory, and if we do a directory listing here. We can see that there's a um, file called edit, and edit is actually a, um, text, ed a text editor I wrote in um, one of my experimental languages called Cobalt, which is a um, it's like a Java like language, but it's also really similar to C plus plus in that you can do more with pointers and such. But if I try to run this program. Just by typing in edit, 
you can see we have a um, line editor. So yeah, and then exit, and I cannot save this file because um, Grunt is not allowed to write in this directory because that directory is owned by system, just like the um, profile directory that we deleted. So I can't actually save this file. But, um, oops. There we go. So, um, yeah. Now, if I, um, restart, it's probably going to crash. Just because the file, the beautiful that we deleted profile, has um, profile information for the user front. So I try to log in now. Um, it's probably going to crash. Yep, it froze. And I cannot log in anymore. So, um, that's it for this video. Um, thank you and have a good day.